30-year-old Natasha Harris drank up to 10 litres of coke every day, twice the recommended safe daily limit of caffeine. The Invercargill mother of eight died suddenly in February 2010. She was found slumped against a wall, gasping for air in her bathroom at home. In his finding, coroner David Querer made a connection between her death and her coke consumption. It is more likely than not that the drinking of very large quantities of coke was a substantial factor that contributed to the development of metabolic imbalances which gave rise to the arrhythmia. His decision also revealed Ms Harris likely suffered from a myriad of other health conditions including liver problems, a racing heart and missing teeth which her family say had rotted from coke drinking. But Coca-Cola says the cause of death is far from clear. In a statement the company told One News the coroner himself acknowledged he could not be certain what caused Ms Harris's heart attack, therefore... We are disappointed that the coroner has chosen to focus on the combination of Ms Harris's excessive consumption of Coca-Cola together with other the health and lifestyle factors as the probable cause of her death.